this is a, an Aquarius reading for April um, April 19th to April 26th yeah April 19th to April 26th for Aquarius uh, there's a sign card I saw a sign card and um, That could mean uh, you are feeling some sort of joy in your life, happiness coming your way. Uh, emperor, emperor to the king of swords. Um, some something might happen that shifts your energy, uh, expands your energy. Something that's a tower falling, a tower caused by failed plans. Uh, you might have had plans towards something and those plans didn't go to plan, didn't go your way because uh, something wasn't solid and uh, the tower had to come down. That shifts your energy from the emperor who kind of looks like he has the devil under his feet but the devil is around him so I feel like even though you were in this energy you kind of had some misfaults, some faults, a lot of faults. And it puts you, oh yeah, it puts you in this um, King of Swords. Instead of, well, you still have the devil, but this devil has grew, grown up to have the world under him. So, you might not even be changing. You might be growing. Yeah, you're growing. Yeah, growth. Growth in work and uh, relationships. Recovery in relationships. Uh, investing in um, in situations that you feel like will make you a better person. Situations that. Trying to, trying to invest in situations that move you to a better place, but I feel like in what you do, you're trying to avoid making mistakes or having to face yourself to some extent, and some balance needs to be made. Um, it's just... Something then go to plan and balance is needed. You might be walking. You might be walking away from um, a situation and focusing on your work, uh, or focusing on something that really needs attention that needs to be worked on. Uh, and that something is gonna move you forward uh, towards a chance to change your life, a chance to become a new person, a wheel of fortune, uh, fortune coming your way, luck. Queen of Pentacles, uh, nurturing energy. Uh, even though you're walking, you you you're walking not focused on work, but you know walking and paying attention to other things around. And uh, with the five or oh no six of uh, wands, you might be receiving love, trying to balance things out. Being the Queen of Wands, Ten of Pentacles, uh, S of Wands. Uh, but you know you might be starting even pro new projects. Uh, taking you might be having directions. Mm. Hold on. Uh, 
Yeah. Still means the same thing. Um, I was looking up the Empress and it just means. And it just means, uh, yeah, fertility, something like that. So be careful about pregnancy. Yeah, be careful about pregnancy. Yeah. Pregnancy and just abortion. Be, be careful of that. Oh, uh, somebody might get pregnant. Somebody might try to take a pill. And that pill doesn't work. I'm going to stay away. Seeing this, I don't know. That looks like failed plans, right? And then coming this way, it just shifts to the justice. Balance needs to be made. And honestly, this person is looking, look, look, look like the hand is like looking at them and being like, I don't know. If I misinterpreted it, if it doesn't resonate for everybody, it's fine. It's just, lately I've been catching these vibes of somebody might get pregnant. And uh, I'm going to stay away from this shit. I'd be more afraid of uh, this, this thing. And it's fine. It's fine. Um, uh, I feel like maybe I have to say this or not. I don't think... I know it sounds stupid as hell, but uh, just be careful. Don't don't make rough. Don't don't rush. Don't rush to make decisions. All right. Before you make a decision, just sit down and take a breath and really uh, try to think a lot before you make a decision. And something, something might not go to plan for somebody. And they, something might not go right for somebody. And uh, it's going to bring fear in their heart. It's going to feel like, it's going to make them feel like they're naked or, It's gonna make them like they're used. I don't know. I feel like somebody might be getting freaky. I don't know. It's like this Queen of Souls is like she has on clothes. It's just the next card is like she doesn't care. She's just. The one with everything, you feel me? Like that vibe of like, the, let the breathe, let, let the breeze, let the air hit my ass. <laughs> let the breeze, let the air, let the fan, like, spreading your legs and let the fan hit the ass. I don't do that, it's just, I get a lot of vibes from that. And it's fine, but it's fine. Just don't fuck. <laughs> Um, and uh, with this energy, it might be like somebody might uh, might be taking this too far, or might be taking the whole shit too far, and some something something might not go as they think it, sh it would have went. Or I don't know. Let me get into this weekly reading. I mean, that's been ten minutes, and I didn't say shit. I feel like to do these readings, you really gotta have a really high energy. 
and they don't. I wish fulfillment comes true, you see it, and you're like, huh, fuck it, and um, you're like, what the fuck did I do, and then put you in your head. Three nines. And one four. It seems like a lot of fear. A lot of fear. From this. Maybe. From this. From this cup you just throw away. It might be an opportunity you just throw away and it just creates a fear. Or something you might have been... Uh, Miss treating, misusing, just just uh, something you didn't pay attention to, and I feel like you lost it. Now you realize that you lost it. It kind of puts you in this fear that this is not part of the deck. It was down, but this just shows. This just tells me like you might need some time to rest. Because of this uh, heavy energy of uh, I want something, but I'm not getting it, and it's creating fear in my heart, and it's keeping me up. Your wish is coming true, it's just you might be f scared in the waiting process.